offer that we gave our, our NREA is, is now on the board. It's all prior tentative agreements. It's a salary increase of 2% in each of the four years of the contract. The first 2% would not be on the salary schedule. It would be a one-time payment. Um, the next three years, a 2%, 2%, and 2%, which is on the salary schedule. And this is in addition to the steps that the union members will receive. We've also offered a $20 an hour increase, um, or I'm sorry, a 20, we've gone from $20 to $25 an hour for special project stipends. And the board will also fund an additional $100,000 each year of the agreement to the district's health trust as an effort to keep the membership costs reduced. So what that does um, is provides our board um, increases at the next slide. The board would, um, proposal would provide the following increases um, through, through the year of the contract. So if a teacher has a bachelor's degree, um, you can see there that their increase 2% the first year and then it goes up, including their steps. Six point master's degree, you get your 2%, 6.5.8, 5 5.7, and a master's plus 30, 2%, 5.3, 5.2, and 5.1. So this is the offer that was made. This is our last, best, and final offer. We are at impasse with our union. This is not up for discussion tonight. Um, this is for informational purposes only. So it's so that money can't be used for salaries. 
Um, the other thing about when people asked previously about information and we would not give that information is because we were not at impasse at that time. We did not make our last, best, and final offer to the union at that time, so it would have been a unfair labor practice. Okay, so what, so just out of curiosity for my own clarification, what makes the difference between you being able to openly talk about it when you've reached impasse versus when you're not there? I, well, I don't know all the legal jargon. I'm, I'm, I, know I'm, that. I just, I just want a summation. I'm, I, don't, I don't want to get in a philosophical a, argument with you about it. I just I don't it's understand. It's a legal issue, and our attorney advised us on that. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I Thank appreciate you. it. I appreciate you staying. Thank you. If you approach the podium, podium. <laughs> I, I know that you said that this is the last and final offer. Yes. Um, I'm just curious, uh, since you've made the offer, have, has the union rank and file uh, voted on the offer that you've provided? I'm not privy to that information. I do not know. So you, is there anyone who would know? How would we find out uh, if the uh, rank and file have had an opportunity to vote on this offer, which appears to me to be a, a, really, a really good offer, and I, I'm, I, I would take it. <laughs> Thank you. You'd have to ask They're in the parking lot. So oh, okay. Well, I don't want to go out in the parking lot. <laughs> Tom Honor. I live in Fairview, 20897 Westwood, Fairview Park, Ohio. I just wanted to put on the record that uh, I am the union president for the support staff, and we do support our teachers. I think our teachers are some of the best in all of Ohio. They really do care for our students. They do always put in the extra mile, and, and I'm very proud to know our teachers and respect them very much. And uh, I also wanted to mention that one lady said, you know, like the bus drivers, and we're all underpaid. You know, and we're still, we do love our school, we love our kids, our aides, or all the support uh, people care about our kids, and that, and we do honor our teachers and everybody else here. And uh, I just wanted to bring that up to record for the people that are still here. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you for Thank waiting, too. I appreciate it. At this time, it is recommended the Board of Education enter into executive session. No. Second. Uh, moved by, oh, sorry. Moved by Ms. Tamir, second by Mr. Lyons. I'm sorry. Um, personnel. Personnel. Um, roll call, please. Ms. Tamira? Yes. Mr. Lyons? Yes. Ms. Saxon? Yes. Mr. McCarthy? Yes. Thank you. Thank you all for coming. Good evening. Thank you all for staying. You're not going out there with me.